In this video, we're going to evaluate the Merge Conflicts Community Package. This allows you to resolve merge conflicts directly within Atom. So let's take a look at how that would work. So in this case, I've got an index2.js with a simple hello world. So I'm going to create a quick feature branch to make some changes. So I'm going to call this branch1, and we'll go ahead and make a simple change called hello world branch1, and I'm going to commit that code. I'm going to check back out my master branch and create another feature branch and call it branch two. In this case, I'll just say hello world branch two and commit that as well. So now I've got a merge conflict scenario where I've got two particular cases that are trying to be merged into master. So I'll check in my first one. So I'll get merge uh, feature branch one. So that's a clean merge because essentially there were no other changes in the master branch and it's pulled that in. So now if I look at my code, it says, hello world. But now if I go into merge the second branch in, I'll notice that it's resolved in a conflict. So uh, Git has told me that. And now if I navigate back to Adam, I could see that in fact, yes, here it is a uh, conflict. So now all I need to do to activate the merge conflict plugin is hit the command Alt M and then press the D button. This will put this will activate merge conflict detection and scan your entire project to determine if there's been any conflicts. So in this case, you can see that my uh, first line here is the head or the master branch in which we merged in our original update. The second item here is the branch that I'm merging into. So feature branch number two. This allows me to interactively pull in the branch that I would like and resolve the merge conflicts directly in line. In this case, I'm going to go ahead and use the second feature branch. In this case, it's the only merge conflict for this style file, so I can go ahead and stage this commit directly within Atom as well. Uh, this also resolves all my merge conflicts, and mer the merge conflict tool informs me that everything is ready to go. So now if I go back to my command line and do a git status, I'll see that everything is ready, and I can just commit that updated change. So this is a really handy tool to be able to perform these merge conflicts directly within Atom.